with steam costs to power soot blowing operations in a single recovery boiler reaching an estimated $6,000 a day, or roughly $2 million a year, imagine the savings plant operators could achieve by optimizing soot blowing. The key to soot blowing efficiency is knowing where to clean and when. If your plant utilizes a utility or recovery boiler, do you know where the soot buildup is located in that boiler, or are you cleaning blind? This video will illustrate a solution developed by integrated test and measurement that will greatly increase soot blowing efficiency and decrease unplanned outages, both of which will result in significant annual savings. In a typical boiler, fuel is burned inside the furnace, creating hot gas which heats water in the steam generating tubes. In the case where the fuel is coal or black liquor, the flue gas often contains a significant amount of carryover, which collects on the boiler tubes causing buildup. This buildup, also known as fouling, decreases the efficiency of the heat being transferred to generate steam while also increasing the risk of plugging the boiler and taking it offline altogether. Typically, soot buildup is removed via the soot blowing process in which rotating soot blower lances are inserted horizontally through the boiler while expelling pressurized steam or air to clean the soot off of the boiler tubes. Estimates are that plants use between 2 and 6% of total steam to operate soot blowers. Extrapolate that cost across the recovery boiler industry in the United States and Canada, and those total expenses reach roughly $400 million a year. These facilities operate via unmanaged soot blowing. In other words, there is no real-time indication of where buildups are occurring to inform when and where to operate soot blowers. As a result, soot blowing schedules for individual lances must be determined by common operating practices. Cleaning the boiler tubes in this manner may ultimately get the job done, but it's similar to putting out a house fire by flooding the entire neighborhood. Not only is this soot blowing method an enormous waste of steam, considering some boiler tubes need to be cleaned more often while others need to be cleaned far less often, it can also negatively impact operations. Blind soot blowing has proven to allow buildup to remain in certain areas when soot blowing isn't occurring often enough. And conversely, soot blowing too often on clean boiler tubes has proven to cause tube erosion, which then leads to expensive unplanned outages. There is a way to optimize your soot blowing operations. The Soot Blower Fouling Detection System, or the SFD system, designed by Integrated Test and Measurement, is a proprietary technology for the measurement of fouling along the path of a soot blower. This system has two primary purposes. One is to help understand where fouling is occurring in order to optimize soot blowing. The other is to provide real-time data for control systems which will allow for targeted soot blowing. Both of these will result in immediate savings in steam consumption, prevention of tube erosion in areas with little to no buildup, and increased boiler efficiency in areas with significant buildup. The graphic displayed here gives a demonstration of how the soot blower fouling detection system is able to monitor the level of buildup within the boiler in real time. As the soot blower lance enters the boiler, instrumentation along the lance delivers feedback to pinpoint where the steam is encountering significant buildup. An increase in the amplitude of the response indicates buildup, and a consistently low amplitude response shows operators where no buildup is found. Let's take a look at how boilers with and without the soot blower fouling detection system respond to areas of low and high buildup along the path of specific lances. This graphic shows two systems, one with SFD and one utilizing unmanaged soot blowing. The unmanaged soot blowing system continues to operate at the same rate, no matter what the level of buildup. Notice, however, that the system with the soot blower fouling detection system actually finds that there is little to no buildup along the path of this specific soot blower. At this point, this crucial information informs automated controls or plant operators to decrease the rate of soot blowing. In the end, the SFD system results in immediate savings due to less steam being used and is an excellent method to prevent tube erosion, which occurs if boiler tubes without buildup are being cleaned too often. In this example, we again compare two systems, one with SFD and one without. These lances, however, are located in areas with significant buildup in the boiler. Notice that the unmanaged soot blowing system does not run the soot blower lance often enough to clean the foul boiler tubes. Without SFD, operators have no way of knowing that this area has a higher degree of buildup or that the buildup is costing the plant steam generating efficiency. The soot blower fouling detection system, on the other hand, detects the buildup and the rate of cleaning is immediately increased through controls logic or via manual input by the operator. Taking this a step further, if the control system is in place, the soot blower lance can target the specific location of high buildup and focus on cleaning that section. These improvements will directly result in an increase in efficiency of the superheated steam generation process, providing more power for the entire facility. The soot blower fouling detection system is the solution to inefficient soot blower cleaning processes. 
Managing your soot blowing based on ITM's SFD technology will increase the overall efficiency of your boiler's steam generation process while also mitigating the risk of plugging the boiler. In the end, reducing the number of soot blower operations decreases the risk of tube erosion, saves steam, and saves money. Our goal at Integrated Test and Measurement is to provide efficient solutions to address your company's needs and to maximize the efficiency of your boiler processes. If you're ready to take the next step in increasing the efficiency of your soot blower cleaning process, please contact ITM by phone or email and ask about the soot blower fouling detection system.